Today we will install Azure Monitor Agent using uh, Azure Policy. Azure Monitor Agent is a new uh, agent uh, that replace uh, old agent like especially the log analytics agent. Okay, we can just do that by the by configuring Defender for Cloud, but we can also just do it in that way. We can just go to the policy, uh, go to definition and search for something like that. Configure machine to create the user defined Microsoft Defender for Cloud Pipeline using Azure Monitor Agent. Okay, let's wait when uh, all definition loads. Okay, we can choose that we wouldn't like to use just one policy, but set of the policy and now uh, let's search for that. Okay, there is a definition of uh, set of the policy and everyone installed the um, Azure Monitor agent for different workloads like Windows, uh, Linux, uh, virtual machine scale set and so on. Okay, so let's assign that one. Let's choose the scope. Okay, and there I have a management group, so I choose a root management group, select, no exclusion, assignment name, I always prefer a name, install Azure Monitor Agent, so let's go to next and so now I need to browse a log analytics. Select the subscription. Where is the log analytics and something like that. And so workspace region. So in my case it is East US, but always check where is uh, your log analytics. Workspace, uh, log analytics workspace. Okay. Remediation just here and create a manage identity. Use system assign manage identity as a most secure. Okay. It is good. So next I can skip non-compliance message next and create okay the uh, policy has been assigned to the management group we can just check it here if you have more, just search by name. It is that one. And there is remediation that needs to be executed. For the old resources, you must execute them manually. For the new resources, it will be executed automatically. Okay, so if you would like to speed up uh, or process of policy evaluation, we can just use this REST API. And I will browse this site and then uh, let's try it. I need to sign up.
Ok. Ok, so I need to provide a resource group name uh, and let's provide uh, an example. Okay, this resource group name, this subscription, and that's all. Run. So just I invoke the API. Uh, API has been in invoked correctly and now I can wait for the policy evaluation. It should immediately without uh, waiting. And so I see that this policy, I have no compliant resources to of them. Then I can go to the remediation and then I can remediate uh, the policies to make the mm, resource compliant. Just uh, there are several policies, so just I do the tweak uh, and open it several times to be faster. And I have at least one, two, three, four, five policies to 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 run um, policies that install Azure. Uh, monitor agent and I have four so in the each tab I will launch that number five okay so first one remediate second one remediate number three and number four. Okay, I see that uh, now there one resource is not compliant only, just I executed in this video before, but let's just do it once again and moreover I in the meantime, I change the scenario to the Linux one, but it is simply the same. Okay, and then let's wait. After execution, we can just uh, check the virtual machine extension tab. I created that one in the meantime uh, and go to the extension and here you have uh, Azure monitor agent it is that one and the other one it is just all old log analytics agent so in this way you see that a new log uh, Azure monitor agent is working and sending the logs. The old one log analytics legacy one is still working here. And there is ad one additional agent installed via the policy Azure security Linux agent. So all of them are working correctly. In the meantime, you can just visit my uh, blog where I started uh, some post about the Azure Monitor Agent uh, versus Log Analytics Agent and the behavior uh, to of them. So you can just read more about that. That one is a part one, another one 
ていてあまりがちそうな。